perfect. Hey, what's going on, everyone? You know who I am. I'm Nick. I'm Nick Saint, owner of One Love Lawn, veteran owned and operated, based right here in Grove City, Ohio. So, hey, check it out. We're out here um, in Grove City doing a little bit of edging and cleaning for uh, a client that we've had for roughly uh, three years. Most of our clients we keep and we have kept since we started. So, uh, Miss Love Day, her. Her husband passed uh, two years ago, and she's been having a real difficult time keeping up on the property. And uh, we volunteer a lot of stuff, and she's an awesome client. So, Miss Loveday, I know that you're probably watching. We love you, and uh, thank you for all your business. So, I'm going to put your uh, property out there like I told you that we would, and uh, show everyone what's going on. So, uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. So, you guys can see that... There used to be an edge here, the bed, the flower bed, um, but over time it has went away just because, you know, Mr. Loveday was not able to keep up with this at one point. It's a beautiful property. It goes all, they have a backyard too. It goes all the way down. We'll walk back there here in a second. So the number one thing when we walked up today, we seen that her downspout, all this right here, that was actually up under here nothing was coming out none of the water was coming out there was a lot of water um standing water right in here when i showed up this morning so we went ahead we stretched it out trenched it out a little bit to get that runoff for so the first thing i'm going to do when i do email her when i email her this afternoon I'm going to ask her if she's got any water damage in that basement down there because I know that they have a basement. So I'm going to ask her if she's got any water damage and then I'm also going to give her Joe Lawler's phone number just in case she wants to go ahead and call a, a, a home inspector to come in check things out and if there's some issues he might be able to help her out, uh, direct her in a better way. So the grasses, everything was cut last fall, everything was cut back last fall. All these grasses are huge, huge really big nice flagpole this is what I call the old school security system by the older folks and you'll see these in older homes they put a lot of shrubs out in front of their uh, windows it's called the old old school security um, but eventually these shrubs are going to have to come out because they've reached their life expectancy at a certain age now the taxes you can see starting to die down through here the major issue why I do not recommend you put any kind of shrub next to the house a lot of these taxes people don't understand that their roots run and they will run into your house and it's just like putting a, a tree or a small tree right next to the house you're taking chances of those roots going into the house. So I would always recommend you put your shrubs off of the house, never next to the house like this. That close is not good. I would recommend you keep them at least four feet off your house, not two feet or one foot, because these roots do run. And a lot of these taxes, they, they live for a long time. And they get huge, 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 huge. How big they are up top, they're three times bigger on the bottom. So always watch that and always watch where you put your plants. Because also, when you put these shrubs next to the houses, you're, they're acceptable to the burn and a lot more freezing and frostbite just because of the brick or the structure of the home. So once again, I'll flop this around so you can see how close they are. It's not even a foot. Everything's burnt out and it's dying. Number one is because of the heat. And number two, they're so close to each other. But it's the old school security system. The Burberry is the same way. So you can see that it's dying down through here. So we'll just keep clipping this back, clipping, clipping, clipping throughout the season. And we'll check back in on it in the fall. It'll probably be more of a tabletop in the fall time just because of all the clippings so <laughs> guys I'm going to get this uh, cleanup done 
I'll uh, toss, toss some pictures up later on so you guys can see everything. You see I got the big boss with me today and uh, she's not playing so I'm going to leave you with a uh, view of the property. Some more beds here. All these grasses. So all these beds here as well. So, you guys have a great day. Everyone pay it forward. One love. You're watching In the Garden with One Love Lawn, Pro Corner. We're sponsored by Nobody. We use Xmark and Echo. We're powered by Body Armor.